Hello everyone and welcome back to another Space Engineers Let's Build. Today we do a lot of work that's going to make me upset. Um, that's a weird note to start this commentary on. Anyway, so I'm working on these new cells. I'm going to go through this weird shape that I've been working on since last episode. I'm not sure if I like it still. And I, I, plan, I paste them onto the ship uh, in this episode, but I'm still not sure. I'm probably going to remove them and try again. Um... And then we completely remove the engine bay <laughs> and start blocking that out again. Um, I realized between recording this, oh, we recorded this Tuesday. So yeah, we actually made last uh, Tuesday's stream, which hopefully we'll be making today tonight's stream as well. So for those of you who don't know, I stream this every Tuesday evening. So same day it goes out, I record the next episode um, on a live stream. So the details are in the description. Um, and I'm probably tonight on the stream going to be removing the armor of both the ship again. Um, so hopefully I can remember to actually, well, on stream, if I don't remember, I'll be looking at Pinterest and going through different, uh, styles of armor on ships, whether that be bulky or something. I have starting to get a, um, like a headcanon of what the ship is used for and what kind of, what's the company that makes it. Um... And it is more it is definitely a very civilian type um, transport. Uh, so that's kind of one of the things I want it to be very kind of civilian, very um, not very industrial, very Carillion, I guess. Like the uh, was it the T seven hundred T four thousand or something? Um, the ship that is the Millennium Falcon. Um, to be not modular in the same respect, but very this is this ship and this is what it does and it does its job really good and uh, it's not like armored out the wazoo and it doesn't have guns a lot of them but it does its job well so i want to lean more into the industrial side but i also want it to be a very high-tech look i don't want it to be a like a junkyard or a tug or something like that so at least we have some direction for the final art to go that I didn't have when I started this thing, which was a bad idea. I still want these uh, nacelles to look a bit um, more rounded, so that's probably why I'm going to end up redoing them. So anyway, enough rambling. I will let you guys watch the rest of the uh, time lapse in peace, and I'll see you guys for closing comments.
Alrighty. Well, this this episode was more um, more cringy and more um, more depressing than most of the other uh, videos because I was ripping out moat all just the entire engine bay and one it was tedious to i actually did really like the engine bay i liked how cramped it was but there were some spaces especially like under the catwalk that just didn't make any sense um so eh so hopefully hopefully tonight on stream we'll get get some things straightened out a little bit more we might do a lot more building um than we do recording kind of trying to line stuff up i might end up i might end up trying to reconfigure the thrusters the, th the three thrusters on the main hull uh i'll think about it i don't know uh, so if you guys have any ideas or suggestions on how to lay out or different looks for the engine bay or for the armor set i desperately need help so if you guys got ideas put them in the comments uh, i love reading all the comments uh, especially the ones that are like yeah i love the ship those definitely inspire me to keep going with this if not for those comments i would not be doing this this long i would if i've given up a long time ago and i can't wait till this ship is done so that i can um move on to hopefully a smaller ship this time uh, i plan to do like a small if you guys know star citizen uh an aurora size kind of thing maybe slightly bigger maybe like 300 series so more like a cutlass size basically a little like jumper van jumper van camper van something like that anyway that's all i got thank you all for watching like the video if you liked it and subscribe if you haven't already to see more star citizen not star citizen space engineers related content and i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys